Hey there YouTube, I'm back again. I have another doll video. This time I've got the Monster High dolls from Mattel. Now these weren't going to be released in Australia, but they have finally made it here. This is the entire first series that Australia received. We had Gulia in our first series, which is totally awesome. Um, in each shipping box comes one of every doll, except there's two Draculauras in every doll. Um, the Deuce and Cleopatra set come separately and they are 60 bucks in Australia which sucks because that's so expensive for dolls and the single dolls are 30 bucks each so that's kind of pricey as well now one thing I absolutely love about these is the detail in the fashions and in the accessories I mean the earrings are awesome the facial um, paint is awesome and the detail in the clothing is just awesome as well I cannot tell you how awesome I think they are, except Deuce, I think he looks like a fag, excuse the expression, I'm allowed to say it, um, and he is stupid, his heels are pointed, like, you know, he can, he can wear heels if he wanted to, I mean, he fits, in, he fits into the, um, moxie teen heels, so, you know, you can make him dress up and drag if you want, um, love the shoe detail and the fact that they've actually put a bit of effort into it, and it's not like the Mycene shoes, which were just like, glove things that went over the entire foot they come off completely and you have toes see your toes poking through there um, my favorite's Gulia mainly because her piano belt and her cassette um, handbag I think that's awesome and the little clip on the handbag actually opens and closes which I think is awesome um, I think her face is awesome and I love her little glasses there they make her look so cool um, next would be Frankie, because she's just totally awesome, and I love her face, because she looks so cute. Now, the only thing that bugs me with these dolls is the quality in their joints. Now, I work in a toy store, as some of you know, and the legs do snap quite easily if you are rough with them or don't pose them correctly, which really, really sucks. Um, and also, the hands, when you pull them off, they can be really, really hard to get back in or they just keep falling out and become really, really loose and floppy. One thing I like is the posability on them. As you can see here, Dracula is doing a bit of a freaky pose, and um, Clear's like, yeah, whatever. Um, in the TV, sh or the cartoon um, that's online, I really, really hate how Mattel have given Laguna such a crappy accent. Australians don't actually talk like that. Seriously, we don't. Anyways. Um, that's my little rant. Um, I think they are awesome, and I can't wait until I go to America at the end of the year, oh, end of August, I should say, so I can go buy a whole heap more, and hopefully I'll be able to get the Claude and Dracula set because Claude is absolutely cool, and I'm hoping I can get some of the newer characters as well. If not, I'll just buy everything I see that I don't have. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.